In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a soldier or sailor course in AutoCAD. And this is important because typically we're using soldier or sailor courses on the edges of patios or walkways. And the more information that you can convey to contractors, the easier that it is on them for communication. So you are drawing more detail to convey more information. So to create a soldier course, along a, let's say a rectangular pattern. I'm going to use the rectangle command. I'm gonna type in D and I'm gonna draw a patio that is 12 feet by 12 feet. And we're gonna use the command offset to offset this line by a typical soldier course is about eight inches. So I'm going to offset this exterior line by eight inches. So I'm gonna select the line. I'm gonna type in offset and I'm going to use eight inches. And we can see here that the blue line represents the line that I previously drawn. And I can go on either side of that line to add a soldier course. So since 12 feet was the perimeter, I will offset eight inches to the inside and hit exit to complete the command. Now we are seeing a soldier course line that is eight inches off the perimeter and we can hatch this inside line with a paver patio. And now we have a soldier course with a paver pattern on the inside. And this same command offset is helpful for curvy walkways. So if we were to use the command spline and draw a walkway that leads to the paver patio, we can type in offset and we can offset this curved line by a typical distance of four feet. We could trim the excess off by using the command trim. And to complete the walkway, I would like to connect all the dots together. So I'm going to use the polyline command. I'm gonna select the components of the walkway. I'm gonna type in join, and I'm going to use the offset command and because this is a sailor course, a typical sailor course would be about four inches. If you're looking at a typical brick, uh, four inches by eight inches. So a sailor course is running the long way. We're gonna type in four inches. And we'll want to select the line and hit exit to enter. Now the important thing about offset is that when you're constructing any type of uh, project within AutoCAD, you want to make sure that your points are lining up directly on top of the other point. And to do that, you're gonna use the O snap mode. And that's just making sure that you're snapping to the line, because if you are not snapping to the line, the hatch command won't work. So if we typed in hatch, I'm gonna select the interior lines here. I'm gonna hit enter to finish. Now we have a perfect offset of four feet along this line. We have a four inch sailor course and we have an eight inch soldier course on the square patio. Subscribe now for more videos or go to www.thelandscapelibrary.com for AutoCAD training specific for landscape design. And we also have more tools, resources, and trainings.